and sisters and friends, at this time when we are locked in on account of the coronavirus scare, at this time when many people are afraid, when fear may be killing more people than actually the coronavirus, I have come with another word of encouragement. Jesus, the Lord, the risen Lord, whose resurrection we celebrate at this time, Jesus has assured us of victory. Our task at this time, while passing through the valley of tears, our task is to constantly ask the Lord to come. And so the role of Christians going through difficult times, going through tribulations, going through persecution, going through disease and epidemics and pestilence, our role is to constantly pray, come Lord Jesus. Come Lord Jesus, Maranatha, was actually the prayer of the early church. It was the constant refrain of the early church, come Lord Jesus, do not delay. Come Lord Jesus, bring the promised kingdom. So I like to read from the book of Revelations, chapter 22, verse 16 to 20. I, Jesus, sent my angel to make these revelations to you for the sake of the churches. I am of David's line, the root of David, and the bright star of the morning. The spirit and the bride say, come. Let everyone who listens answer, come. Then let all who are thirsty come. All who want it may have the water of life and have it for free. The one who guarantees these revelations repeats his promise. I shall indeed be with you soon. Amen. Come, Lord Jesus, come. So I'll sing this song which I call, Come, Lord Jesus, come, sweet Savior.